please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to be notified of the latest videos. I'm Sage at Kalkine Media. Thanks for joining us on this trending topic. Three ASX retail stocks not to be missed. MYR, JAT and WES. The Australian retail space is a significant contributor to the country's economy. And while it did face the adversities posed by COVID-19, the pandemic-induced lockdowns and the sector has gradually come to terms with the changing scenario. Today, in this article, we'll focus on the latest developments related to three retail stocks that are trending on the Australian Securities Exchange, or ASX. Meyer Holdings. Financial year 21 sales are up 5.5% and despite the challenging retail market conditions amid the COVID-19 pandemic, this Australian-based departmental store chain managed to score high on all metrics in the financial year 21. The company posted strong sales growth with a rise of 5.5% in total sales, reaching 2 billion Australian dollars. The group online sales grew by 27.7% to 539.5 million Australian dollars and accounts for 20.3% of the total sales. Also, there has been growth in EBITDA to 390 million Australian dollars. This is up 27.7%, higher on the prior year. And the net profit after tax stood at 51.7 million Australian dollars. JATCORP jumps on the ministry approval in South Korea. And JATCORP has received approval from the South Korean Ministry of Food and Drug Safety for its Ginvigorate diabetic formula to be used as medical food in the hospitals and clinics in South Korea. Ginvigorate diabetic formula is a special food supplement which is manufactured at JATS ANMA factory in Melbourne. It is designed to address the nutritional needs of diabetics and JATCORP is one of the leading producers of supplementary food products and plant-based meat. JAT has been serving the world's largest retail markets with Australian goods varying from nutraceuticals, cleaning products, cosmetics, milk powder, wine and organic oils. West Farmers modifies proposal to acquire API. West Farmers has executed a process deed with Australian Pharmaceutical Industries one of Australia's leading healthcare and beauty companies in relation to the acquisition of 100% of API shares via a scheme of arrangement and the revised proposal of $1.55 Australian per share represents a 37% premium to API's one month volume weighted average price of one Australian dollar point one three three cents per share to 9th July 2021 prior to the initial offer by West Farmers. It enables paying dividends fully franked of up to five cents per share, including any final dividend for the financial year 2021 for API shares. Ended 31st of August 2021 with the $1.55 Australian cash consideration to be trimmed by the cash component of any such dividends. If you do like this information, please like, share, comment on the video below, subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon, you'll be notified of the latest videos, but for more information and regular updates, please head to the website, calkinemedia.com. Sage here for Calkine Media.